today I'm going to do another fairy glow jar, but um, I've done fairy glow jars in the past, and so I decided that I was going to do the ultimate fairy glow jar, in which I'm going to fill up a jar full of glow stuff. So I bought tons of glow sticks, I'm going to cut them all open and pour them into this jar and see how cool it looks. So here is how I made my ultimate fairy glow jar. So you're going to need a jar. Um, I'm not really sure what size yet because um, I just bought tons and tons of glow sticks. And I try to fill up the jar um, as best as I can with all of these glow sticks. Um, the best glow sticks are the thick ones. You kind of have to shake them out. And you're also going to need something to cut open the glow sticks with. Like a sharp pair of scissors or a knife. Um, so here are all my thin glow sticks and some thick ones. And I'm going to cut the tops of them. I've already activated them. And I'm going to cut the tops up and just put them in another jar here on the side. This part's really dangerous because there is glass inside. You'll actually hear it hitting the, the bottom of the glass. Uh, when you do it, um, please do not pick up the glass or touch it or put your fingers anywhere near it. It's super dangerous. And definitely if you're under the age of 18, ask your parents to help you on this. Don't just do something crazy like this. The little ones, you have to actually shake them out. Um, so you just kind of like rattle them around the, the um, jar. And you guys actually can't hear the noise that it makes, but it sounds really pretty. It's like ding, 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 ding. <laughs> so here we have the jar filled up halfway. There's lots of glow stuff in there and pieces of glass, of course. Um, we are just pouring them in as we go. We have so many more glow sticks to go, so hopefully we can fill the whole jar up. And we've turned off the lights, and this is the brightest glow jar I've ever made. It is so bright. The camera is not doing it justice right now. Um, and in fact, I think I'm actually going to pour it into the smaller jar. It's slightly smaller so we can see. Wow, look at that. Look at how much bigger the glow became. It's just got so much brighter. And I put some glitter in there. You can't actually see the glitter on camera, but it looks really pretty in person. And more glitter, because, you know, you can never have too much glitter. Wow, isn't that amazing? That is all glow stuff. So cool. The brightest fairy glow jar ever. And here is the remnants. Here is our mess. So many glow sticks. Oh my gosh. Crazy! Thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed seeing how I made my ultimate fairy glow jar. Um, it was very cool and fun to do, um, but it was also dangerous. Watch out for those glass pieces. Make sure you ask your parents' permission before you do anything crazy like this, okay? If you're not subscribed to my channel, please subscribe. I have tons of craft ideas and fun things to do when you're bored. Bye! Bye!